Hey guys, One Piece Nation here today to do an anime tag video, and I would like to thank Standard User Double Zero for tagging me in this. So thanks a lot, man. But I just gotta bring up. I'm looking at the question right now, and yeah, let's answer. Them. Who is your favorite anime? Your favorite male anime character? Now, this is a tough one. This is a tough one because ooh, I don't even. This is really tough. Fa if I had to pick at the moment, I have no all-time favorite. If I had to pick at the very moment, I I'd probably say Luffy at the moment. Yeah, Luffy. Who is your favorite female anime character? Ooh, oh, fuck. Fuck, I'm going to get so much hate for this. Now, guys, listen. This is my opinion. Just because I like a character doesn't mean you should hate me for it. But I'm a big Sakura Haruno fan. I really am. I have my reasons for that, which are, which are mainly the way the character was written. And I do plan on doing a video about that eventually. Because that's like a really in-depth thing. But yeah, my, my favorite female character at the moment would probably be Sakura Haruto from the Naruto franchise. <laughs> what is your favorite anime soundtrack? Ooh. Overtaken from One Piece. Definitely Overtaken from One Piece. Favorite anime ending? No, oh, I skipped one. <laughs> favorite anime opening? This is tough. Um, well... Maybe. You have know Dragon Ball Super opening. Opening 2. The second opening of Dragon Ball Super. Or really opening 1. Both openings of Dragon Ball Super. I know it's kind of a cop out, but they're pretty much the same opening, just with different visuals at a certain part. So, yeah, so the Dragon Ball Super opening, I love it. It's, it's so nostalgic. It just, I, when I first saw it opening, I'm gonna be honest, I almost cried tears of joy. I mean, I would, I literally, Dragon Ball Super would be the only anime to ever make me almost cry tears of happiness. I mean, it, it happened a little bit at the end of Naruto, but that was more like, you know, nostalgic and sadness. But Dragon Ball Super, I would just, cr I almost cried if I felt like, I felt like 10 years old again. And I'm only 15. And I'm only 16. <laughs> but yeah. Favorite anime ending? Ooh, I don't always watch the ending, but, um... I don't even know, um... Oh, God. I, I don't watch a lot of the ending for anime, so shit, um... You know what? I would say if I pick my favorite anime ending of all time, it would probably be that one One Piece ending you get like run and like a ton of awesome background. I'd probably pick that. If you give me any anime character who I would say Weiss. Honestly, Weiss is probably who I would want to meet. Now I know you're thinking why Weiss. Actually, no, I take that actually back. I just thought about that. No, I would want to. I would probably want to meet. Master Roshi, and f I either want to eat Matt. I would either want to meet Master Roshi. You know, I want to meet Goku. I want to meet Goku so I can force Goku to train me and and to, and try to convince him to gather the to gather the balls to gather to let me, to give me the Dragon Ball so I can become a Saiyan and just blow shit up. You know what I mean? I would be you know, I. I would want to get a lot of training and become really powerful, and I couldn't do that much with Master Roshi's help. But I also don't want to train with Weeks, because Weeks would probably fucking kill me. What anime character most similar to you in terms of personality? Ooh. Probably... Maybe Naru... I don't know, um... Maybe Naruto for Naruto. I feel like I'm pretty similar to him. I never really thought about it. <laughs> favorite thing in an anime is... My favorite thing in an anime is that... Anime is not afraid to go far. Alright. If you think... 
that there there could be a cartoon aimed towards teenagers in America that had that had an entire village getting that had people getting crucified and tortured by some guy named Jack. You're crazy. That wouldn't happen. All right. That would not. I don't think that would fly in America. Definitely not on a theory are targeted to like fifteen year old boys. But Christians would go crazy. Now, but religion aspect, religious aspect, a whole other thing. But I don't give a damn about religion. All I care about is the story being awesome. And you know what? And I, I don't see that ever happening. I look at the anime; they don't care. Like in manga, like nobody was afraid. To have Oda do that. Like, I, like, you know, Oda just did it. Oda was just like, whatever. Kiki, like, you know, another example of when, uh, Naruto and Saki lost their arms in Naruto, but in theory. Nobody cared. But they just lost it. They're all going to blow it off. Nobody even paid the slightest mind to that violence. Because nobody that read manga cares about violence. People read manga and you're reading an action theory. You're going to affect it to get it as violent as it needs to be for that thing to happen. Which I really like. Least favorite thing about anime. Now I could give a cop out and say filler. But I'm not going to do that because filler isn't always a bad thing. In some cases such as Dragon Ball that can sometimes be a good thing. Most of the time it's bad, don't get me wrong. But I'm trying to figure out how to answer this question. Hmm, least favorite. Well, I can tell. Fourth, I was talking about least favorite. My least favorite anime, anime but that that the fairy tale anime, the thing. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But um, yeah. I just, I realized I was late on this, so I kind of just sat down to record it. But so my least favorite thing about it would probably be the stereotype degenerate. You know, like the stereotype. All anime fans will read porn. I hate the st- I hate I hate that anime generates so many stereotypes. I really hate that. I don't know why it does, but it did happen. Now, yeah, but guys, that is all I had today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. I had something big, a big project I need to get back to work on. I hope to have the project up and running by tomorrow. May not happen, but whatever. But guys, above all else, have a great day. But before I go out, I need to test some people. By the way, the people I am tagging are Real to Real and Master J202. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. It's a One Piece Nation signing out. Have a great day, guys.